You're going to take your right ankle and place it over the left knee. You're going to grab just inside the back of the leg on the left side. You're going to tuck your chin and look through the little triangle of your leg. You're going to Everybody on their backs. We're into the stretch. We're going to stretch out the glute max and the glute fibers first. Both legs bent. You're going to take your right ankle and place it over the left knee. You're going to grab just inside the back of the leg on the left side. You're going to tuck your chin and look through the little triangle of your leg. You're going to dorsiflex your foot that's on the, uh, the knee. You're going to push your sacrum into the floor and push your knee away from the head. Exactly. Exactly. And Laura, I want you to work on this chart. You look through the legs. That's going to get you through a stretch. And so you're going to feel this eventually after you do this. You'll feel the stretch happening and feel you get more space in the surface on. And Mike, you've got to get your head down. Exactly. You tuck your chin. Yeah. Yeah. And if it's too tight for you to do that, I use a wall support. It's just easier to get in place. Okay. You don't have to worry about that. But you can still work on the top of the chin. Look through. That's it. Right, look through. That's it. That's it. Tuck the chin. Very good. Push the sacrum into the floor. Push the knee away from the head. That's it, Lush. And slow release. Always slow, soft release. So there's no recoil effect. Other side. Ankle over the knee. Dorsiflex the foot, slip the hand through, tuck the chin, eyes looking through the little triangle, drive your sacrum to the floor, push the knee away from the head. Very good. Dorsiflex both feet, fascial tension, that's good. Eyes looking through the leg, push the knee away from the head, sacrum to the floor. Very good. Push the knee away from the head, sacrum to the floor. Excellent. Very good. Everybody's going to turn onto your side gently when you come out of the stretch. Both legs bent. And we're going to do a global postural stretch. Both legs bent. Facing on your left side. Both legs at a right angle. You're going to take your bottom arm and grab the knees. The head is going to be on the floor, but the chin is tucked looking to the knees. Like so. Grab the top. Part of your leg here, this, this active both legs stack. Take your top arm, maximal external rotation, and bring it back into a 45 degree angle back there, reaching. Good. Pull the fingers back. Turn your body more this way. Look this way. Tuck your chin, look to the knees. Grab his hand to the knee. Yeah. Exactly. Maximal external rotation. Everybody, just drop your head Breathe into the rib cage and then exhale and reach a little more. That's it. Breathe into the rib cage. Exhale, reach a little more. Breathe into the rib cage. Exhale, reach a little more. One more time. Maximal external rotation. Breathe into the rib cage, reach a little more. And soft release. And other side. Great job. How'd that feel? Really good. Nice stretch, eh? Other side. Both legs bent. Bottom arm grabs the top of the knees. Your head's on the floor. Your eyes are looking to the knees to create that little tuck of the chin. Dura stretch. Bring the hand up. Maximal external rotation. Bring it back into a 45 degree angle. Pull the fingers back in the Aldoa hand position. Myofascial tension. Very good. Reaching. Now, increase the volume of the breath into the rib cage. As you exhale, you reach more. Maintain there as you hold there on the breath in. Exhale, reach a little more. Good. Inhale, and exhale a little more, and reach. Good, very good. Inhale, and exhale, good. Eyes looking down to the knees. Very good, two more. Very good. Soft release. Fantastic. Everybody's going to sit up. We're going to do an alto.